You never know who you're going to impact and when. So I just got into my car. I had to run into the store really quick. And I'm standing online and there's a mom and her daughter uh, standing behind me. And the daughter, uh, I think, was like 10 years old, maybe. And I'm standing there and I had a really bad night's sleep the night before. So when I have a bad night's sleep, for most of you that don't know, if you're new to my work, when I was seven years old, I had uh, a bad reaction to something at a wellness visit and developed Tourette's syndrome. And um, one of the things when I don't sleep well or I'm under stress, uh, things can flare up. So I'm standing online and you know, part of mine is like, I'll do that, like, you know, shake my head a little bit, whatever, and those are like some of my symptoms. And I saw the mom looking at me, and then I'm looking at the daughter, and I kind of see her expressing symptoms of Tourette's, and I'm like, wow. So I didn't say nothing, and the mom taps me on the shoulder and says, you know, excuse me, I couldn't help but notice, do you have Tourette's syndrome? And, uh, it just brings tears to my eyes because it's like you just you never know how God is going to work and when right it all comes back to that trusting his timing right like we don't know anything although we think we know everything we don't know anything especially when it comes to like where we need to be and when now I'm aware that people that follow my work uh, due to the messages I get from a lot of you guys uh, on a frequent basis of just being inspired and motivated from all my other stuff. Um, but when something like this happens in person and I was able to, after I paid my stuff, I waited for them outside and we had just had a great conversation and I was able to drop so much information to this mom to try to help her daughter. And... Um, it was just a beautiful moment of, again, surrendering to his will and trusting where you are at that very moment. And it's interesting that this happened because I'm going through some challenges right now in my personal life. And, you know, it's lately had me like reevaluating a lot of things in my life, um, including my, my mission and my purpose. Um, and when something like this happens, it, it always happens like this. Whenever I step back and I start to question, like, what am I doing? Something like this will happen or I'll get an email or several emails from some different random people who follow my work. And it just kind of brings me right back to my mission. And I know that the master of chaos and confusion is the devil himself. Um, so anyway, it, it, it just touched me and I just wanted to share this with you all. If you're going through something, look, we all have something that we're fighting. Again, my daily thing is Tourette's syndrome. It affects a lot internally, mentally, um, quality of life, all that, which is why I'm so committed to my work on myself and then sharing that knowledge with you all. So no matter what you're fighting or what you're going through in this very moment, um, if you're going through a rough patch or if you're just questioning things, whatever it may be, I'm here to tell you as just a reminder, and it's not like you haven't heard this before, trust his plan, not yours. Where you're at right now is where you're supposed to be, even if it's not pleasurable or enjoyable for yourself. Where you are at right now is where you are supposed to be. And whatever may unfold after that, with the right amount of effort and intention and prayer and visualization and action that you take behind all that, sky's the limit. So stop questioning and start standing affirmative that you are in the palm of his hands and you are in fact being guided and you never know along the way who you're going to touch and inspire.